Monday defeat in his inaugural match in charge at Preston. Paul Mariner presides over Plymouth for the first time at home and needs to pick up points quickly. Argyle have lost four on the bounce and a six from safety. Coventry are struggling too ahead of this match. Their victory seven days ago against Peterborough ended a ten-match winless streak. A big three points. He's up for grabs then at a cold and frosty home park. Plymouth did the double over Coventry last year. It was 4-0 here at home park as Larry Ou comes and just about clings onto it and gets a free kick for his troubles. No goals in any of their last four games for Plymouth. Here's Judge hoping to end the wait. Straight at Kieran Westwood. Only two home wins for Plymouth coming into this game this season. Remains goalless at the moment. Chip forward ball is a good one to Eastwood. He found the man in the middle, but it was a tough chance for Michael Magindo. Ball down the middle is causing a degree of trouble at the back for Plymouth. It's a real nightmare, and here's Freddie Eastwood hoping to make them pay. Wide it goes. The stats are bleak for our goal coming into this one. They've lost more than anybody. Scored less than anybody and have the worst goal defence. They could be behind. Oh, it's a brilliant clearance off the line. And then blazed over the bar. Well, how Coventry City aren't ahead. I'm not sure anybody in this stadium knows. That's a terrific block initially from Carrie Arneson. The rebound should have been put home. Long throw into the box. Westwood comes and punches. But only to the edge of the box. Fearsome effort. And some terrific blocking. Eastwood holds it up, but his pullback is a bit too hard for the fullback. And forward it goes. This time Eastwood wins it well. Fletcher. Home fans urging their side on. Judge into the box. Good delivery. Fallon heads it over. And it remains nil-nil. Who can't break the deadlock? It's been keenly fought. Perhaps lack quality at times. Very entertaining, that's for sure. Fallon's header. Not for the first time. The New Zealand international goes close. Decent ball into the box. He leapt well, but couldn't quite direct it goalwards. Plymouth, of course, celebrating the fact they're in the 2018 bid. They make it a double celebration with three points this afternoon. Well, it's Coventry on the attack. It's McIndoe's ball. Eastwood's header. 18 minutes to go. And Coventry City, who haven't won at home park since 1965, have the lead. He scored a hat-trick in the victory over Peterborough seven days ago. And he's found the back of the net again. Inviting ball. Thumping header. Here's Paul Mariner. On his way to a second defeat out of two. Fallon flicks it on. And it won't fall for anybody. Eventually Fallon hits it. And strikes the post via a deflection. It's a corner. It was so, so close to the equalising goal. Westwood was beaten, that's for sure. Still there's a chance. Noon to whip in the corner. It's a decent one. Arneson was up highest, but it's off the line. And it just about sums up Plymouth's day in. Perhaps their season so far. Coventry's goal leading a charmed life. On it goes to Medin, who's happy to hold it up. Coventry on the verge of back-to-back -back wins for the first time since the first two games of the season. The Boos ring round home park. Paul Mariner loses his first game in charge at home. Plymouth still marooned at the bottom.